geometry theorem class 10 for all over the world a b c d angle angle b equal to angle d angle b equal to angle d and this angle e angle e equal to angle e therefore triangle abe triangle abe and triangle cde cde this is dcd cde cde these two triangles are similar now this is input this is input for second theorem This is A, B, C, D. This one P, Q. <coughs> this, this theorem is here two times. This theorem here two times. Let this is X, this is Y, and this part Z. Therefore, <coughs> applying this input Applying this above input z by x, z by x equal to dq by dq by d, db. This is b. dq by db. Similarly, z by y z by y equal to z by y equal to bq by bd this is equation one this is equation two what happens what happens if addition is done z by x plus z by y equal to dq plus bq by D B B D B D equal to bd and dq plus bq equal to bd equal to 1 now apply <coughs> now multiplying both sides by 1 by z, 1 by x plus 1 by y equal to 1 by z, 1 by z, z, z cut, 1 by z, z, z cut, 1 by x, 1 by y, 1 by z, proved. Therefore, this is main question, to prove this, above theorem is useful that is why in place of above theorem input is written with this input this is our output with this input this is our output now <coughs> i think this is very nice very easily done mathematics is not a phobic subject Constant practice is the remedy. Students are requested to follow my <coughs> all videos. Besides students, 
their guardians and political leaders, religious leaders, all social guides are requested to demonstrate my <coughs> YouTube channel. I have a desire to give more than 1000 educational videos. Thanks to all.